This one was the second Paris Juarez out of Obstacle Ninja Academy. Oh, and I just saw She Paris. came in second place in 2019 for the ladies. She is currently leading full swing by five seconds. And likely going to win that event. So this is a Lachey heavy stage. She may be our best chance yet to have a girl through stage one. And you can see Hunter Gerard on the sidelines helping her out. She is making quick work of this course. And what I like about the fact that she won full swing is that you know she knows how to link movements and execute them. You know that she's visualized this splat a lot at the very end, probably with the anticipation of maybe not having quite as much time to execute it. So I really do think that having just that awareness and the ability to execute laches and link movements, that's going to be a huge advantage to her if it gets down to time. But she's not quite as fast as Katie Bone was through that point. She only had about... 50 some seconds left. But I'm liking this movement that I'm seeing. I was a little crooked. Makes a second jump. Yep, a little crooked, but definitely high enough to give herself time to make those grabs. Here we go. And a she's, grimace. That was a grit. She <laughs> knew that was a try hard moment. She's going to need to get moving here. All right. Come on, Paris. Come on, Paris. Where's that dismount? She didn't get a lot of swing, and that's going to put her under the gun. On splat a lot, starting to run out of time. And we're going to need to get the dismount here. She's going to have to go immediately. There it no! isn't. She was running out of time and had no other choice. That and does put her in fourth place. She'll finish off the podium for the world championship. She will definitely be in stage two. I can't wait to see what she does on that 100%. stage. 100%.